In today's session of Divorce Court, Cecilia Rainey says her husband Kevin is nothing but a dirty, rotten scoundrel. Kevin has fathered four children by three other women during the marriage. You thought it meant that you could still have all the women you wanted? Yes. Oh, come on. <laughs> she know I'm a ladies' man. Lime green suit and purple, as pretty as it is. Not too many men wear that. Those are my colors. He gave me $1,500 to marry her, to get her up out of her parents' house. Yeah, I've been around a long time, but this one is real new. Yeah, who would want to be around me? <laughs> who would want to, I mean... It's the case of Cecilia Rainey versus Kevin Rainey as they face the judge in today's session of Divorce Court. Court is now in session. Maybelline Ephraim presiding. You may be seated. Good day, ladies and gentlemen. This is the matter of Cecilia Rainey versus Kevin Rainey. I'm advised after nine and a half years of marriage, you're ready to end it. Mrs. Rainey, why? Well, during the nine and a half years of, well, it was more like hell instead of marriage, Kevin has fathered four children by three other women. What? During the you marriage? You knew during what type the marriage. Of person I was, Four. Though. What happened? Four. To, and you stayed Your there Honor, through knew, the first one and the fourth one? She knew that I was. Wait a minute, Mr. Lady. Rainey. Let me finish, please. Four children. Four. In the nine years you've been married to him. Yes. By four other women. Yeah, one who was a 17 year old girl. And you stayed what? through all of that? Yes. At the time, Your Honor, you know. Mr. Rainey, what, what's your response to that? I mean, well, you know. She knew, she knew what type of person I was before she married me. She no, knew I'm a ladies' man. No, I didn't. You're no. a what kind of man? A ladies' man. What, what kind of lady? I mean, you know, uh, she knew I, I liked to party, and I'm still, I was still, you know, having fun. She knew, she knew I didn't that. know he was a... So since she knew you wanted to party right. and have fun, she shouldn't have married she you? Is that what you're saying? Me. That's what I'm saying. So she then should... why did you get married? Didn't your name get signed on that license certificate, too? At the time, I didn't, under I didn't understand the meaning of marriage. I didn't, I didn't know it was just serious. You know, she paid me. <laughs> she she Yo, paid me. She, no. Oh, she paid me. Hold on a second. She paid me to marry her. Oh, no, oh, she did. She gave me gifts. What? She, she me bought gifts. you? She brought me. She pimped you. <laughs> well, no. if that's what you want to say, she pimped I'm me. I'm not saying it. You're saying it. She, that, no, yeah, Your Honor, she Your pimped Honor. me. She brought me, you know. No. I, t I told her. What you, how did she pay you to marry her? Well, yes, she was giving me get, she was giving me gifts and you know taking me places. If a sweatshirt is a money. reason for you to marry me, you not a fool. No, not no sweatshirt. Your Honor, he paid no. for us to get she, married. Hold on he second. paid for she the apartment. Me, he paid wait, for wait. all the bills. She, I, she gave me on, fifteen hundred dollars to marry her to get her up out of her parents' house. I wish I she had fifteen hundred. No, she, she was up under no, her Mr. parents. Rainey, Mr. Rainey, slow yes. down. I don't want to miss this at all. <laughs> I want to make sure that I hear Your what Honor. you're saying. Because trust me, I've been around a long time, but this one is real new. $1,500 to marry her? $1,500 to marry her because she was, she was up on her parents. She was wanting to get up out of her parents' house. She figured the only way that she could get up out of, from her parents was to get married. So, How you old know, were you, Mrs. Rainey? I was 19. And if I had 1500 I could have just moved she had myself. 50 on it. She had $1,500. I wouldn't have wondering. to pay for food getting, she to was marry me. Money. I married him because I she loved was him. In, she, well, I told her before it all happened, don't fall in love with me because you know what type of person I am. And I got a lot of females. I was messing with her. I was messing with her friend. Why did you take we the got marriage vows? I didn't, I didn't, I didn't know the... Un, How know were the you? He don't understand Mr. much, though. Uh, I was 20. Oh, come on. Don't 21. give me the bull. Yeah. You knew what was marriage 21. was all about. I, Cut the crap. Shit, I didn't know what marriage was about. I didn't understand. And he ain't taking time to try to learn You weren't either. ready to accept and do what it was about. There is a big difference. Exactly. Now, you're going to sit here, stand there, and try to tell me that you didn't know that when you took the marriage vows that it meant that you were committing yourself to one person. If you didn't know it before you walked, uh, went to, before the minister or whatever, you knew it when he was saying it. The gifts, the gifts brought me. No, 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 but you were trying to make me believe that you didn't understand that marriage meant a commitment to one person. The vows say that. I promise to cling to you. you Your Honor, Forsaking may I say something? all others. Did he say that? May I say something? No, just answer my question. It said that, yes. Did you hear it when it was being said? Yes. 
and you didn't think that it meant that. You thought it meant that you could still have all the women you wanted. Well, yes. Because oh, come on. When it happened... Okay, but now explain this to me. What about having all these children? You didn't well, know that if you had sex, you could have children? She... Tell me you didn't know that. Yes, I knew that. So I how do you that. explain four children? Was that my... wasn't Mrs. Rainey. That's you. They was my girlfriends. And she knew... She knew what type of person I was. Okay, no, forget about Miss Rainey that. knowing that you could have four, you were that type of person. What, she had... Miss Rainey, She, she had, had other... Hold what on, drove hold me on. to that? I'm asking a question. So she knew you were that type of person. Right. You're trying to tell me that you don't care about the children? You just run around fathering children? Is, you no, I treat them all equal. That? I treat all my kids equal. Like nothing. Which means what? <laughs> I treat them all equal. Like nothing. What I have... Treat like them all the same. Like nothing. Treat them the same like they ain't nothing. What I, like have, they don't what I have, I give. And what, what I do have. you have nothing. and what do you give? <laughs> what, well, what... Well, you know, I, I work a seasonal job. You know, it's season in and season out, you know. And, you know... So the children have in some seasons and have not in other seasons? No, ma'am. It don't work like that. You know, I, I try to do the best that I can do for them. Question to you. Yes. After the first child, outside of the wedding... The first one he denied. She what was couldn't... the explanation? The first one he denied. She, could, she couldn't really speak on it because... And the just second as... one? I was a fool, and when I married him and I took my vows, I meant it, and I loved him, and I thought that that was going to be the end of it. <laughs> what redeeming qualities did you see? What made you want to marry him? He what used to be a him? nice guy. In the streets, and running around? Yes, but that was something I That's wasn't truly nice exposed guy to. In because the streets, see, running around. Well, you can't, now I know you can't tell me. You now can't tell that. me yourself. Not one redeeming quality this man had that drew you to him. So yeah, maybe it was to get from under your parents' control no. and, you, and you didn't bother to check out values and what a person was all about, what their goals were, where they were headed, what he wanted out of life, what he had done up to age 20. Did you check any of that out? I checked it out, but it all ended up being a lie. That's why I have nothing to stay How here and tell you. had you known him before you I had you known him a few him. years. And in a few years of knowing him, I've known him five minutes and I figured him out pretty good. <laughs> this all a cover to make him look like he, he the man. So when he this first a, had... All, it's a man. front. It's a front, I'm telling you. Hold on, Mr. Rainey. Let me get it out mean, Look at who you. Want, who who would want to be, be around what? me? <laughs> who want, I mean, look oh, at me. <laughs> look at me. I mean... Looking like Barney. Whatever. She, when Divorce Court returns, Kevin testifies about Cecilia treating him like a toy. She was trying to turn me into a model. She wanted me to put on strip shows for her. And the judge sizes Kevin up. A lime green suit as pretty as it is. <laughs> Not too many men wear that. It makes a statement. If you would like to have the judge hear your case in divorce court, call us toll free at 1-877-311-2222 or email us at www.divorcecourttv.com. Divorce Court is back in the case of Cecilia Rainey, whose husband Kevin fathered four children with three different women during their marriage. It's not funny I'm, to me. No, no, no it's think, not funny to okay, me either. And to say who would want to be around She me? was trying... She, what it really was, she don't, she don't talk about uh, the things that she was trying to turn me into a model either. She wanted me to put on strip shows for her. She was miserable. She was trying to see what was no, out no, there no, in that, no, no, in that no, no. world because she was always in the house. She didn't know. No. And I told her. I told her. I said, don't fall in love with me. It's a big Because I'm not worth it. That's right. But she didn't I'm listen to I'm not working, and I ain't no good. I told her that. I said, I ain't no good. Now, you know, that means a lot when the person tells you. I told point. her that. No, that, no. I told her. That statement I did come, her. but you want to know when it came? When? After the fact. No. After the marriage? After a couple of years. See, you could have you could see, you could see through that. Any, any person who should have been able to see I through that, see through what? that I wasn't no good at that time. I, I wasn't Mr. No Mr. Rainey? <laughs> I told no, you that. No, he did not. You know not. what? I believe that he probably I told you. No, he did not. And I showed it. I was about to That's say. That's right there. It, I mean, what she's, what she's speaking <laughs> on Rainey, is, is showing no. it. I have the... I'm of the opinion, and I have to accept him as a credible person, that he either told you with his lips or he showed you with his actions, and you did 
because people don't change overnight. And a leper don't change his spots just like that. But what we do is close our eyes to what we don't want to see and try to make a person be more than or other than or something than they are not. And particularly under your circumstance, when you're in the house, you're naive, you don't know what's going on outside the world, you need out. And unfortunately, you're not the only person who's been there. It happens to so many people. But now that it's happened, you need out. I mean, you, Mr. Rainey is the type of man that, like I said, five minutes, and I figured it out. I mean, I have a little age on you, a little maturity on you, a little more experience. But you can tell by his character, the way he stands here, that he can't hide who he is too well. A lime green suit, as pretty as it is. <laughs> hey, I want to be... Lime green suit and purple. Those are my colors. Hey. Not too many men wear that. Not too many men dress that flashy. It makes a statement, just like what you put on makes a statement. And I know he didn't just start wearing lime green suits. <laughs> she know it. I wear yellow, all type of color. She know it. Because you think, you, you think that that's what makes you a ladies' that man. That is not how he always dressed. And makes you a womanizer. It's not anything to brag about because you know what? No. It, hold on a second. I'm on you now. <laughs> it doesn't take much of a man to do that. It takes much of a man and a person to make a commitment, to say I'm going to be monogamous, to make a commitment to go to work every day, to exercise some discipline over his or her body. That's what makes a man. Anybody can go out and do what you do, as long as you have the right equipment. Now, my understanding is you're not taking care of those children, at least one child, because the court papers say that your wife wants you to pay your daughter's tuition that you have by this person, your wife, and she's paying all the tuition. Now, you said when you were 20, you didn't know about commitment, faithfulness, et cetera. You have a, how old is your child? She's seven. She'll now, you know she's in school, school, don't you? Yes. And you know she but has to I go didn't to school. Know, yes, but I didn't know that she was in that type of yes, school. Yes, you did. Why you that didn't, type why, of money. And he didn't know that. Kept, why he did, told me don't send her there. this she, is things that they did. She ain't did better than nobody behind, else. That was behind you my back. Mrs. Rainey, She me, trying to keep up with her sisters. She, what, what would they would say, the Joneses. She trying to keep up. Can't afford that. Is it something that you could have afforded? Was it within your budget? Was it within reach? Or is it just something that you wanted something, ideally? It was something that I was having regardless. She was trying to keep up with that the you were what? I, I was having regardless. The community I live in. What do you mean you I, were having regardless? Whether he it paid meant, or not? If, no, it meant if I if that meant I couldn't shop as much That's as I wanted like to, she said, I was going to make no a way difference. for my daughter to go to it that school. No so it was, it was so, something that you wanted bad enough that you were willing to make the sacrifice. That I made to do the it. sacrifice. There's a lot of things she, I don't she get to even do. She couldn't pay her bills because I'm going to pay rent, pay. car note, insurance, and tuition. I'm going to make sure the necessities are taken care of. And I got a, and I got a car note, of. and I got other kids that I got to take care of. Mr. Rainey, you care of I keep them all equal. Look, okay, my daughter. Look. You oh, want to I'm try sorry. another approach? Yes. Yes, you All know. right. Okay. My daughter, I get her the best things there is. Except an education. Yes. You I get her, her education, too. You buy a lot of nice too. clothes. Is that he it? Don't I, get, I, I preach that to her all the time. Education is, is important. Preaching to her and paying Between for it is not... She, she go to a school 35, 40 minutes away from where we live Now, in. let me say something. $2,035 a year is only $169 a month. $169 and a few cents a month. That's too much for your daughter that you love and you give her the best? She, 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 she figured Keep that. She would, take for, she would take care for that. Yes, I'm in a study. You she really stubborn on that because yes. you know that that's not a lot to ask. When divorce court returns, the judge renders her verdict and an update on the case of Latanya Williams versus Charles Williams.
You just wanted to get in the bed with this man, right? It was for sex in the beginning. <laughs> Divorce Court will be back in session in a moment. Divorce Court is back in the case of Kevin Rainey, who says he's a ladies' man and admits to fathering four children with three different women during his marriage to Cecilia. Tuition. Has he paid any of it? Have you paid can any say, of it? Can I say something no. about the tuition? And he don't even work. Just tell me, can... have you paid any of it? Huh. No. But he paid support to go to on a regular school. basis? Huh? Have you paid support? of any kind to your wife yes. on a regular basis? Yes. No. I take care of her. I no. pick her up. I do I do the little you I do he, the things you know that she can't when do. When he want her to go into a beauty pageant? I pick her to pick beauty up. Pageants. I yes. pick her. She I was pick sick her. As I do a the dog. things that she You wanted she to do modeling. Do. She, didn't you hear him say she, he, she I should have sent her to modeling school? I mean, she That's finna be all eight years old. I'm looking about. at her future as when she be you eight years old. You think you're making to do a dollar modeling. for you? How's I'm going to make a dollar for you when no, you got custody of He came to my Mrs. house. Mrs. Rainey, hold on. It's all the benefit for her. Don't look. It's all the benefit for her and my So daughter. you wanted to go to modeling school? Yes. Can I give you an example? But you don't want her to learn her ABCs. Yes. I want her. She'll learn that too. I mean, go go to a school where. You would get some. I mean, she does get all these. Does the child have any interest in modeling, or is this you? No. She got interest in. No, she doesn't. Because well, you she think got interest in music. He trained her to call him Kevin. She done brought all type of music. So she when you go out into... and pick up women, she, she don't... won't say daddy. To all right, that's, I'm going to end this. Your child is in school. The tuition that's being paid is less than a hundred. It's one hundred sixty-nine dollars, almost one hundred seventy dollars per month. If your wife is paying part of it and you pay the other part, that is not a lot to ask. You have to pay at least $100 per month. That's not too much. Not at all. That's the court's order. And the tuition that she's been paying, have, is that what you've been paying since you separated? Yes, that's what I've paid each year. This and is how long have you year. been separated? We've been separated off and on most of the marriage. The last separation? A year. Okay, so the tuition for last year was 2035. Yes. So 2035 for last year, half of that would be 1,000 and something. <laughs> she I'm don't know the date. Mr. Rainey, close she... your mouth. 1,017 dollars and 50 cents for last year's tuition to reimburse Mrs. Rainey. And I'm going to ask order you to reimburse that at the rate of 200 dollars per month. And then you're going to pay another $100 per month for the current tuition for a total of $300 per month. That's the order of the court. Court's adjourned. All rise. When divorce court returns, an update on the case of Latanya Williams versus Charles Williams. Have you ever seen your husband with anyone else? Yes. He came to the door, his penis was hanging out of his underwear. He had lipstick on his face. Closed captioning for Divorce Court, provided by. If you would like to have the judge hear your case in Divorce Court, call us toll-free at 1-877-311-2222 or email us at www.divorcecourttv.com. And now for an update on a previous case in Divorce Court. LaTanya said she married Charles to prove a point to his family, but that was a big mistake. It was for sex in the beginning. <laughs> you just wanted to get in the bed with this man, right? Have you ever seen your husband with anyone else? Yes. He came to the door, his penis was hanging out of his underwear. He had lipstick on his face. He tries to play me like I am stupid. He okay. looks in the mirror and says, there's no lipstick on my face. So I took his underwear and pulled his penis back in his pants, and then he looks down and he goes, oh. No, let me tell you what happened. You catch him dead in the act? Yes. You married him anyhow. Charles pleaded with the judge to award a recliner that he said was bought for him by LaTanya. The judge agreed and awarded the recliner to him. Charles says since their appearance in court, LaTanya has taken their four-year-old daughter and moved out of state. He has not seen or heard from them since. He says he is now working on his music career and has started recording his first rap album. Kevin was only interested in making a dollar off my child. It was wrong. I shouldn't, I shouldn't have to pay for something you know, reimburse. I should, should start paying for right now. I can understand that because I have other kids too. 
and they're not going to no type of school like that. I have a big problem, especially for a man who doesn't even care enough to support himself or his child, but hopes to get my daughter a modeling future, only for he can rake in on the money. It's totally unfair, and he won't do it as long as I'm breathing. I regret marrying her because, you know, it should have never been a marriage. Because we was playing, we was young. Actually, I'm involved with a wonderful man, and we're getting married sometime this year. I don't think I would never get married again because, you know, it's, it's, it's easy to get married, but it's hard to get out of it.